Contemporary Art Fair, Art Basel, kicks off this week in Switzerland. The show's organizers hope to lure high-end collectors of contemporary art with a wide selection on sale, from the oversized installations in the Unlimited section to work by well-known artists like Tracy Emin. Let's take a peek. From art on a grand scale, in the unlimited section of the Art Basel Contemporary Art Fair. To more modest sized paintings by Jackson Pollock. Jean-Michel Basquiat's chalk drawings. And David Smith's anchorhead sculpture in the main halls. Art Basel is a highlight of the year for contemporary art lovers and collectors. There are 4,000 artworks from 280 galleries. The value of art on sale, $2.8 billion. Art Basel is the gold standard of art fairs in the world. There is no place better and no place more important to show. And I think that people always bring out their A-game. They put aside the best of the best to show here because it is the center of the art world. And galleries are the center of the art world. And it's an opportunity for education and acquisition and all sorts of other very important aspects that truly make you not just a buyer of art, but a collector and a connoisseur. And that's what Art Basel offers. This year's show is filled with work by famous faces. From Chinese artist Ai Weiwei's White House installation, a huge temple resting on glass bowls, to Tony Orsler's template variant Friend Stranger, which is bound to leave you wide-eyed. To Gerhard Richter's Prague 1883, with a hefty price tag of $20 million. At Art Basel, fine art meets big business. But has the international art slowdown had any impact? At the beginning of 2015, the first quarter, it felt as if the art market rang the bell at the top of the market. And since then, the market has begun a slow but gradual correction or slide. It's nothing serious, but certainly I think that buyers are looking a little more carefully and thoughtfully. With fairs in Miami and Hong Kong, Art Basel is now global. It was founded in Basel in 1970 and the Swiss Fair always draws the highest profile collectors and buyers. Looking for a Tracy Emin? Or a Paul McCarthy? The main halls of Art Basel open to the public Thursday. They and Art Basel Unlimited end on June the 19th.